G'day, I'm Neil Campbell from Raywater Gerringong. Just up, updating you on the market for the last two months of April and May. In the Gerringong market, we had 13 residential sales, we had three sales of uh, vacant land, and in Jaroa, we had just the one sale over those two months. In Gerringong, uh, the prices ranged up to for the residential homes and units up to 995,000 for an average sale price here, just on 700,000. That's for homes and units. And then the blocks of land range from 330,000 up to 650,000. So, and the market continues to fire along here. Uh, with that average sale price of 700 there, what we've seen is we used to say up to 600,000 in the Gerringong market was, this, was where all the activity was. That has definitely moved up by at least 200,000 now, where we say up to 800,000. We believe that's your strongest part of the market, an investor market. So that's lifted in the last two years by $200,000. So. That's been driven by Sydney buyers and investors from there that aren't able to buy good investment properties in Sydney under that sort of price bracket now. So they're coming down here and they do have money to spend and looking for, particularly in that six to $700,000 bracket, good investment properties. So that's really driving that market. And that's now what we believe has become a very good auction market uh, because it's very, very hard to predict price. But even above that, the auction market is still good, a little bit more difficult, particularly once you get above a million dollars still. Uh, but we have proven just recently of two homes we've just had offers accepted on in Tasman Drive in that higher million uh, price bracket, their auction still does work. So we've got two there that'll actually exchange this week. As well as that, there's just been the two rural sales in the Gerringong market. Um, uh, one of those was a, uh, uh, an old weatherboard home for 775000 over on Mount Pleasant. And just near that as well, a huge price of 4.7 million for a vacant 150 acres there as well. And that's a very, very good indicator of the movement in the rural lifestyle market. Finally, Jiro has been a little bit different, just as I say, the one sale there, which was a unit in Stafford Street, that sold for a very good price actually of 817,000. There's now currently five properties on the market in Jiro, so that market continues to be pretty tight, so not much stock out there. Uh, looking ahead, we've got uh, a number of auctions coming up over the next couple of months, probably highlighted by that, and it's, it's got a fair bit of press, is a property called Pebble Cove Farm up on Mount Pleasant between here and Kaima. Uh, that is a magnificent property. If you haven't seen the video for that property, pebblecovefarm.com, have a look at it. It's just amazing. It's an amazing property. And it looks like at the end of the day, we could create a new record for uh, a price for a rural lifestyle property in this marketplace uh, with interest already over seven million on that property and interest from all over the world on that one. So we have a number of other uh, properties for auction. Uh, three of, in particular, three residential homes we've got coming up down in Shellhaven Heads. We don't do a lot down there, but that'll be a test of the market down there. They're all properties together. They could end up as uh, resident, singular residential homes or could end up as development site. We'll see how that goes. We have two other properties here in Gerringong going to auction next month. Again, they're in that good investor, first home buyer market. A very nice four bedroom home uh, down in Well Street. And then a great little home in Blackwood Street here in Gerringong, just down from our office. We look forward to a very strong market over the next couple of months. Again, driven by the Sydney market as it continues on. And while over interest rates are where they are or dropping, as they have been, we're looking pretty positive as far as the market goes here for residential and rural lifestyle properties. I'm Neil Campbell. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you uh, at the end of next month. Cheers.